So you all know about access modifiers and you know that they tell us about the accessibility of member functions and member variables of a class. So let's see uh, what do these three access modifier mean in the uh, Python. So private member functions or private member variables can only be accessed from inside the class. That means that they cannot be accessed from outside the class. It is as simple as that. They are private. And the public member functions or member variables can be accessed from outside the class since they are they are public. They can be accessed from anywhere. So the protected data members, according to this uh, official documentation of Python, which you can refer uh, here on this link, these member functions or variables should be treated as a non-public part of the API. This means that they are included in the program or function, but they should be considered as uh, something which is which is not for the users to use. This is some detail of the program which is subject to change. It can change later. So if this is something for the programmers, it is not for the public use, but they behave as a public member. So they can be accessed from outside the class as well. So they behave like a public member, but they are not for the public users. They are not for the public use. They can change. And by the API, we mean we mean the whatever application you are making, whatever code or program you are writing. So we have protected data members, but they are uh, they actually behave like public. So there is no difference technically between public and protected, but they are just uh, they should not be used publicly. Now let's see their syntax. So syntax is pretty simple. So for public data members, you are already familiar, you have used them, you just write uh, them like this, just self.name, this is a public data member. And for the private, sorry, sorry, for the protected members, you write one underscore, so self dot one underscore and then model. So this is a protected data member. So whenever you put single underscore before any variable, that is protected. And then if you want to make something private, you put two underscores. Right, two underscores before any variable that makes it private. Now let's uh, write some code and see the output of these variables. Okay, so this is the same class which we just saw, and I have created a, a variable car uh, with the, uh, the the name of the variable. The object is C, and then I have tried to access all these three uh, public, protected, and private members uh, in the print function. So let's see how does it work and what is the output. So when I created this car variable, obviously the constructor should be called. And here you can see that in the derived class, there is no constructor. So that means the constructor of parent will be called. And in the parents constructor, uh, these variables are being initialized and we have a print statement too, which says engine started. So that is displayed here. This is the first line. So that is done. Now, uh, the second line is print C dot name. Now name is a public data member. So Corolla should be printed and that is printed. And then I have tried to access a protected data member, which is C dot underscore model here, which is protected. So 1999, uh, 1999 should be displayed here and that is displayed. So these two things are done. All right, now the third one is C dot make. Now this make is actually a private data member, right? So let's see when we access it, what happens? So you can see this is the error. When we access this uh, member, which is private, we got this error. And the error says car object has no attribute uh, double underscore make. So it's not letting you access it because it is private. So you can see that public and protected both behave the same way. They are, they can be accessed, but private members cannot be accessed from outside the class. Now there is one more question. What is the default behavior of any uh, data member if you have not specified it and you know the answer to it already? The default behavior is public. 